That decision by Judge Braun was affirmed on appeal by Judge Stephanos Bevis, a Trump appointee who agreed and wrote, and I quote, the campaign's claims have no merit. The number of ballots it specifically challenges is far smaller than the roughly 81,000 vote margin of victory. And it never claims fraud or that any of the votes were cast by illegal voters. Plus, tossing out millions of mail-in ballots would be drastic and unprecedented, disenfranchising a huge swath of the electorate and upsetting all down ballot races, end quote. Similarly, as Judge Linda Parker of the Eastern District of Michigan framed it, she said, stunning in its scope and breathtaking in its reach, if granted, the relief would disenfranchise the votes of more than 5.5 million Michigan citizens who with dignity and hope and a promise of a vote participated in the 2020 general election. Donald Trump told his supporters they are stealing the election. They took away your vote. It's rigged. That was not true. According to judge after judge, the truth was exactly the opposite. Trump was not suing to ensure election integrity. He was pursuing lawsuits that would, in effect, strip away American votes so that he could win. In other words, Donald Trump was asking the judiciary to take away votes from Americans so that he could steal the election for himself. <laughs> 